Hi, my name's Jodie and welcome to another video. So today I'm going to be unboxing my fairy loot box. So this is October's fairy loot box and it is a little bit delayed because COVID and stuff like that. But it finally arrived today and I'm so excited to unbox this because October's boxes are always my favourite box every single year without a doubt. And I'm just so excited to open this and see what bookish goodies are in here. I also have no idea what the book is so I'm very very excited and I can't wait. If you would like to see what is in October's fairy loot box then please keep watching. excited though i literally live for these boxes it is so sad oh my dog's coming in okay so my dog did just make a little appearance then but anyway got my scissors let's get this bad boy open i'm so excited i can't remember the theme i can never remember the theme oh i love the spoiler card picture already it's so cool here we have the spoiler card look how cool the spoiler card is obsessed already so here we go so the theme for October was Wicked Hearts, so sounds amazing. <laughs> but they changed it. Right, this stuff is much better. So they changed the purple things to this stuff and this is much better because this is all in one big bundle. So it's so easy to get out. I might reuse this actually, make a little hamper or something for someone for Christmas. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. There's so many goodies in here. Right, I don't know what to go for. Let's just go for this one first. So it looks like we've got playing cards and these are Wicked Hearts playing cards. These are foiled playing cards including artwork from four amazingly wicked fandoms. These were designed by RZ28 um, and these feature characters from The Shadows Between Us, The Beautiful, Sorcery of Thorns and even The Darkest Stars. So I absolutely love The Beautiful. Um, I've read Shadow Between Us and Sorcery of Thorns. They were okay. <laughs> the characters were cool. I really like Celius in um, Sorcery of Thorns. So I'm going to open these now actually to see what's in here. Actually, how do I open these? Okay, I broke the seal but I can't get the plastic off. <laughs> ah! Oh, don't mind me while I just fight with this plastic. So we have our little box here with our cards in. So these have the black edges here, which is so cool. I love that. These are stunning. Oh my God, look at this one. It has a fox on it. <gasps> that is stunning. Oh my God. They are all foiled, as it said in the spoiler card, if it wants to focus. So it's got like this bit here. But guys, I mean, look at these cards. Look. <laughs> these are so stunning. I'm gonna quickly flick through and see if I can pull out some of my faves. I think that might be Celius there from Sorcery of Thorns. So I'm guessing these ones there are Sorcery of Thorns. These are really good quality too. Yeah, these are stunning. I just can't figure out which characters are which. But yeah, obsessed with those. Like they are literally like stunning. Not that I ever play cards, but I guess they're still really, really cool to have. So I love those. Next, I think might be a pin. But it comes in a little fairy loot brown envelope as always. So it says this is an enamel pin by Alchemy and Ink. Oh my god, that is so pretty. That is so pretty, I am obsessed. So this is a Young Elite pin. Um, I haven't read that series, but I'm obsessed with this pin. It says, it is my turn to use, my turn to hate. And it has a little wolf of constellations on it, like a crescent moon. Look how pretty this is. Wolves are my favourite animal, and you know, the word moon's in my username, so you know i say more this is stunning i love this even though i've not read the series that's so pretty so that will be going with my pink collection so i love that let's go for this next so next we have this oh okay we've never had this in a fairy loop before so these are salt and pepper shakers and this is inspired by kingdom of the wicked and these were designed by nova Rantel. these look so pretty i mean i won't be using these anytime soon but i will save this for when me and jamie get our own place <gasps> these are so Stunning. Oh my god. So there's a quote on here that says by earth, moon, and stone, bless the hearth, bless this home. Look how cool this is. This is stunning. Like so pretty. So that's that one there. And then we've got this one. Oh my god, I love it. I love it. So we've got the same quote here, but this one has little moons on it. 
obsessed they are stunning they are so cute so i'm definitely going to keep these until like i have my own place to actually use them in but yeah i'm obsessed with those those are so cute and they're so pretty and they'll just be like so nice like i don't know about you guys but i love like ordinary items like everyday items that are bookish like i don't know what it is about them but i just love anything that's like normal like that is like book themed yeah. I just love these. These are so cool and so unique. So I'm happy with those. Then we have this big box here. Oh, this looks so cool. <gasps> no way. Guys, this is a puzzle. 100 piece puzzle illustrated by Sol Salties. Salties. This is inspired by Caraval by Stephanie Garber. And this is a puzzle. Look how cool this is. I've never ever had a bookish puzzle like this or one in a book box this is so cool i think this is a really really unique item so i will be doing that during lockdown because yeah so fun <laughs> how cool wow that's amazing oh these are different so next we have some stickers so we have some kylo ren stickers from star wars are by saint Dre. i haven't watched the last star wars movie yet because i was so disappointed by the previous movie so i kind of got a bit stubborn and refused to watch the last one um, and i'm not the biggest kylo ren fan to be honest i don't really see the hype so i'm not sure if i'll use these probably won't but these are still really cool you you know you got a little stickers i'll probably give these to someone who likes kylo ren because i'm just not a big fan i love star wars but kylo ren i'm just not bothered by him <laughs> um but i'll keep these this is a cool i'll use the stormtrooper one and then we have oh, there's like stuff from the like sawdusty stuff stuck everywhere so next we have a pair of socks which i'm just trying to get the dusty stuff off and these are vampire hunter socks so they just look like this and they've got like little bats and swords and stuff on these are so cute you cannot go wrong with bookish socks so happy days <laughs> but yeah we just got some bookish socks so they're cool they were by jez hawk and yeah you just can't go wrong with socks i always wear all my fairy loot socks i love them and then we have our tarot cards as well as always so we've got these two no 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 my eyes are tearing up i need to get a grip but is that danica There's, is this danica from house of earth and blood or am i like tripping like is that i'm sure that's danica that is danica right i'm pretty sure that's danica guys these are so cool oh my god yes my house of earth and blood so excited by these oh i love this is so cool i love those amazing 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 and lastly we finally have the book which is covered in like sawdust okay now i miss the purple stuff <laughs> so as always the book comes in this little drawstring bag so let's just get everything out oh i see black sprayed edges no way i didn't realize this was gonna be the book i just got this book this is an exclusive edition okay okay we have our bookmark to match the spoiler card and we have our fairy scoop and we have a very very attractive art print excuse me who are you need i say more but, yeah. <laughs> but we have our author's note here on this gorgeous specimen and then we also have a deleted chapter from kingdom of the wicked which is super cool as well so we have that and then we have Kingdom of the Wicked by Kerry Maniscalco, but the Fairy Loot exclusive edition, which, by the way, <gasps> okay, I did not know that was there. <laughs> Guys, a look at those sprayed edges. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, this is absolutely stunning. So we have this exclusive edition from Fairy Loot with the gorgeous sprayed edges, and this is Kerry Maniscalco's new book, Kingdom of the Wicked. Now I believe this follows basically a girl and her falling in love with like a prince of hell called wrath i think so this follows amelia and amelia is a witch who secretly exists among humans and amelia's sister victoria doesn't come home one night and amelia and her are like absolutely inseparable so she's obviously like massively panicking but then she ends up discovering the body of her twin and obviously she's absolutely devastated and she's found her twin like completely desecrated and obviously like she's in complete and utter turmoil so she vows to like find the killer and get her vengeance so she ends up calling upon some dark magic which is obviously forbidden to try and help find who killed her twin 
but then she meets Wrath, one of the wicked princes of hell. He claims to be on Amelia's side. Tasked by his master with solving a series of murders on the island of which Victoria is the latest victim. When it comes to the wicked, nothing, nothing is as it seems. This is in my TBR for this month already and I literally had no idea this was going to be the book. I probably wouldn't have bothered to get the standard edition if I knew I was going to have this but this is just absolutely stunning. Like I'll show you the standard edition next to it so you can see how stunning this is. So guys look stunning i love it so much it's so pretty and the sprayed edges i mean come on like yeah so love it i'm so happy with this i will have this book actually linked down below if you'd like to read the full synopsis and as always i will have fairy Leaks website linked down below if you'd like to subscribe but yeah obsessed with this entire box and this edition is just stunning and i think this might be one of my favorite books of the year so the fact that i have this nice pretty edition is a very very exciting and oh my god i totally forgot this is gonna be signed i finally have a signed kerry maniscalco book this is amazing i love stalking jack the ripper it's one of my favorite books ever it's so good but i don't have any signed kerry maniscalco books so i'm so happy to finally add on to my collection and i just love this edition so i am very very happy with this box i told you october boxes the best boxes you yeah I love October boxes so much. I am very, very happy with all the items in this box. It's just amazing. I love Fairy Loot so much. They are the best. Isn't sponsored or anything. I just really love Fairy Loot. I've been a subscriber of theirs for a long time now. I just absolutely adore their boxes. And yeah, October is always the best. So I'm so happy. So I'm going to put all this stuff away now. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, then please do give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you'd like to. And I shall see you guys soon. Bye.